Former high school choir director is facing more charges for inappropriately touching students. He was initially arrested last month, but now two more victims have come forward. Action News reporter Aliana Gomez is live outside Central Bucks West High School in Doylestown with the story. Aliana. Well, Sarah, disturbing new allegations coming to light today involving a former choir teacher from Central Bucks West High School here in Doylestown. Now, we're told that teacher is on leave, but investigators are concerned that there might be more victims out there who haven't come forward. A once beloved choir teacher, 56 year old Joseph Ort, now accused of grooming, secretly recording, and sexually assaulting young boys and teens over a span of more than 30 years. We charge a defendant with two counts of indecent assault and two counts of corruption of minors for his predation on two different victims. Bucks County District Attorney Matt Weintraub revealed scathing new allegations Tuesday against the teacher who's now on leave from Central Bucks West High School. This after Ort was arrested February 8th for allegedly using a hidden camera to record a young man. The police reviewed the evidence and found secret recordings of a victim, including one showing the victim in the nude. The initial arrest prompted two more victims to come forward. In 1995, a 13-year-old victim said he was molested while babysitting at Ort's home. In 1991, an 11-year-old boy at Linden Elementary School notified the principal and guidance counselor that he was inappropriately touched, but a short time after, we're told Ort was moved to Central Bucks High School. 30 years ago, no one's held accountable. Instead, the school district moves this perpetrator down the street to a high school. And honestly, I'm disgusted. I like I knew there was something off about him. Action News spoke with a high school senior at Central Bucks West who was in Ort's class a couple years ago and shared with us what he called an uncomfortable encounter. He was like, hey, Damon, I know you're not really um, familiar with the songs. Uh, do you mind coming out by after school and maybe uh, going over some of the songs? And and I would say, yeah, sure, whatever. And then I forget. Now the DA is urging other people who may have been victimized by Ort to come forward. At 1030 this morning, I reached out to the Central Bucks School District for a comment on that incident involving the 11 year old victim back in 1991 when the family reported it to the school. And my calls and emails throughout the day so far have not been returned. Live in Doylestown, Eliana Gomez, Channel 6, Action News. Rick. All right, Eliana, thank you.